Hello and welcome to a the the last episode of Daybreak. This is very sad news because basically uh, everyone in Daybreak chat has left Daybreak. I'm just kind of on the server as no one will come back again, and I, I thought I didn't really record too too much on this server, so I'll do a final tour around it. Sure enough what's been done during its time of being a server, you know, that kind of thing. And also maybe show you a clip of me building that lab over there. So first let's start with the spawn house. This was the first house built on Daybreak, and uh, this was the map design. Uh, no, the flag, I can't remember, banner, that's it. the banner designed by Will, this was a very interesting flag, I really liked it personally, uh, his special items, like Bible, that like Will wrote, and the Holy See down here, if you want to see it, um, I'm gonna replace that back in a minute, hopefully they might Get the map back because I I like I would like to return to this map at some point, but this is last day on daybreak. I will be coming back onto the server after this. Well, it depends, but I don't think it will be. I've flown in bed for some reason. I don't remember why that's here. Here's the chicken farm that was. Designed by me and redstone by Quill because I can never figure out redstone myself. I'm just curious here, yeah, that was the thing. Test for any events that we plan to do, that was interesting. The enchantment table, I've enchanted a few things here. Uh, That was just some flowers from... Oh! Instant health apparently, I didn't remember that at all. For everyone... Flowers, that's what I was talking about when I said flowers. And... Random stuff in here. Here's what was on the message board. I don't mean notice board, I don't know what I'm saying anymore. So there's my pixel load shop that I didn't build for that. The whole time on the server until the very end. I'm kind of sad I never really got to do much with the Pixel Hut shop. I will show you that later because I did actually build it. And then there's the Lab Ready Fury and just 100 depths. I never reached that, but I'm hoping I can get someone on for a later recording. If not, it won't be on the end thing of this video, but if I do, that'd be great. Um, here's the farm that was started at the very beginning. I don't remember what this was. I believe it's just someone's house or... No, it was a shop. And I never shopped it because I got too busy. I'm sorry this isn't the most interesting video, but it's quite a sad one for me because this will be the last time I'll probably log on to this server. The Never Walk Farm from when we went into the Never. That was a fun time. Uh, just the. Uh, I don't know what to say now. Uh, just the. You know, the dam bit where you can mine shafts. I don't know. Just where you mine, basically. Uh, I'll mine. I'll just say that. I'll mine. This was Wing's house. He was the first one to really lose the dress. Well, not really. But. He was the first owner to lose interest, and basically when both owners lost interest, everyone lost interest, and just left the server, so it was kind of sad after. So we'll just give a quick tour of his house, he had these signs up here for some reason. I won't look through this chest, because just more time wasted. Um, his bedroom. He had quite a lot of plans, and it would have been interesting if he pulled off the 
such. Yeah, hopefully I can get some copyright from the music. It's a little more interesting. Um, yeah, this was this bridge which went towards my. Um, it went quite close to my winter house because I basically kind of did one in each season, basically. Well, I've only done it two. I have my ice globe thing, which I was proud of until I made my tree house. For some reason I went in there and decided I'm not going to live all the way in that place. I'm just going to make a house on it quicker and such. And I'm glad I did because I much prefer this house to do. I'll give you a little tour of it because I haven't actually shown it on camera because I built off camera. I had a fun time building it. I don't know why I didn't turn on the recording just to like speed recording or whatever. But I just decided to do this was for the Pokey Lab. I couldn't find mana so I just kind of made it with what I own. A couple of fix my nut with the poke with that lab. I was actually hoping to do a experiment recording where I did something just for fun, but I didn't get around to do it, which is kind of sad. I'm hoping to still do it in a way at some point, but at the moment I have to make a whole new world to do that. So this was just a kind of side bit that I thought would be fun to make. Uh, it didn't take that long though. Then this was like a cookery bit where I could cook like any material quickly and then craft the uh, ender chest, diamond block, gold block and iron block just to kind of show off a bit. And a bunch of materials basically. I, it was fun just kind of playing on the server every so often and I just didn't decide recording it and I was planning to make this like the final base top bit but I just never got around to do it which I'm a bit sad about now, I suppose the next location we've seen the never portal there's the farm there you can see that so I suppose let's get down lower from here because I don't have any armor and I will die if I do that. Even though I've got five deaths to a hundred and that would help but I don't want to lose this stuff for some reason. I did make something in the nether. I was actually planning on making another base really really far out but I didn't get a chance to really do that because I was planning to do an event with a friend there but he was just never online when basically he never felt like doing it with me at all. So he was actually the other the other leader, Joe. He was the other half owner of this place and he kind of just sort of lost interest I guess. I don't know who else this was. Um his Joe's old base. I actually pranked it once and it was quite funny because I just pranked him with like never or stuff. Wait, what? <laughs> I think someone's pranked him with chess. I haven't seen this yet, so this is quite funny to me. Oh god. I don't know if Joe did that or if he was pranked. Uh, I'm guessing it was a prank. Seems like the prank from her wasn't enough. Okay. That's weird, I don't know what happened there. And as you can see there, that's a pixel art I built just for fun. I don't have any better weapon on me for some reason. And I don't know why I should have my best weapons on me. Because this is the last day on it, but no. I'll let this part out. Oh, no, 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 I can't die. Okay, uh, now that's all. No idea what that is, and now I'm gonna die before I get into my pixel art shop. This is... 
Well, there's 96. Now let's zoom over to the pixel art shop. I built it because I thought the server was still running at the time. I was going to show it off in the tour video anyways. Like, I was planning to do a tour video before. Like, everything just kind of went on. It all happened while I was on holiday, so it was just like, Oh, the server's down now. That's kind of sad. So yeah, I, I did this. It, I was quite proud of it. And uh, I kind of wish it, I didn't have to leave it behind, but there's nothing I can do. Maybe I'll rebuild it in, like, my, uh, DM World series, because I do honestly miss that series. I love doing the builds and such, so I think I'm going to bring that back with anything and not just uh, the end of the let's play, because i never seen complete that phase recently, and I don't know why. I don't know what this blue house was for. And probably another shop right here. Someone's cool house here. Uh, I'm not sure what that was. Um, this was obviously a, a, a king of the ladder. That's what I'm thinking of. This quite, looks quite like my igloo, but not bigger and such. So that's kind of a shame. This was a very interesting concept to me. Someone had like quite a few horses. It's a shame I never really got myself a horse on this server. Not properly anyway. Quite a few wheat farms. Sheep. Uh, I was actually planning on doing a pull out for Quill that I built his skin as a huge statue. That was going to be a really interesting project for me. I did build a Neverack base. If I can find a screenshot of it, I'll probably post it up right now. So let's go towards... Oh, is that a giant? Oh, that's an interesting thing. I don't know what that's for, though. But I know how it's kind of done, so I don't know the name of it. This was probably a shop of some sort. Yeah. I don't get it though, so. I think. Diamonds. Oh. Ah, so we're kind of casino type today. It's a shame I never really got on in time before. To see all this, because it's quite interesting. Wait, is this. Is this. Is this? this is a really interesting build. That's pretty cool. No, that that's the house. I don't know. If it's um, but yeah, it was really interesting meeting all the people on this server. Um, I did love meeting people. Uh, these guys, like you know, on chats and that. Because I'm not that open of a person that I could say, but it was still really fun meeting. I've met so many new people through this server. People who are just really interesting to talk to. And I would love to talk to them more. Hopefully I'll have time with university and such. Looks like he never got to finish his house. That's kind of bad. Like, the server seems so incomplete. It, I really enjoyed being on this. Definitely. I just kind of wish more was complete on here because, like, this was a really fun time for me. And I love meeting the people who are here. I would have probably used this to help me with my pixels and the pixel art and such. And this is another quill build. Just pretty much amazes me what he can, what he's done on this server. Uh, I think. Let's 
A lot of time has gone past because I got interrupted and now I forgot what I was saying. But here's another house. I Oh no, that's the one that had that was missing the roof. So let's go over to this chest looking thing. And I believe that's everything on this server shown off. Um Tell me if I'm wrong to anyone on daybreak who's watching this. Oh, there's Quill's farm thing there. He's done a lot on this server. I'm not sure what this was for. I think this is someone's house. Yeah, yeah, this is someone's house. It's a rather interesting one. Actually, I quite like it. Uh... I'm sorry I'm not that interesting of a person to kind of just watch and talk about an end of the server, but I felt like this needed to happen because it's rather sad that Daybreak is over now. I just felt like I need one last time just to record on it, to say goodbye to everything. I'm gonna pick go into the Never Pool and show you what the Never Hub was going to be like. Because it did get created, but it was hardly used as it was kind of never got properly used, basically. Here's the uh, Never Hub. This was going to be Joe's pool, but he never had a chance to do but here's mine. We, we're gonna travel through it later because, well, I want to show you where I spawn. And here is Quill's tunnel. I think I am gonna actually show you Quill's place because I quite enjoy it. So I'm just gonna run there as fast as I can. Probably steal some food because I forgot to get them from, uh, get some chicken from the chicken farm. And I'll cut back when we're at the end. We're getting close as there's uh, some clay here. I think he was going for a really interesting multicolored clay tunnel. I rather enjoyed this idea. I, I thought that his never tunnel was going to be very unique, definitely on the server. I really liked the idea of his never pool. I couldn't decide what I wanted to do with mine yet. I was probably gonna make it mostly I'll tell you once I'm at my house but yeah it was a quite interesting concept he had I just wish he could had time to actually complete it and now we're at the pool so let's go in and see his house and also there's to the, travel to the Mesa because he wanted to get as much clay as he possibly could. I gave him some donations and he has coordinates to a water temple. Uh, he, I think he had plans to make his house completely out of clay, which is very ambitious and I thought it was a very interesting idea. And there was my Neverack build I did for him. I was going to change it into the right coloured warlock for his skin and use white stained clay as the face and such. So that's very good. So now I'm going to look for some food here because I am running low. Ah, uh, that's raw. Let's see. There you go. Because he's not going to be using it. Oh. There you go. He's not gonna be using it, so I might as well just take it. Because I need it right now, and... <laughs> very interesting farm. I wish she could have had more time to develop it. I'm kinda hoping that I could get him on to do my last few deaths. 
because I wanted to do something special at 100. And if I can, I would like to do it. So now I'm going to edit this part out so that you can just see the end of my number. And we're here! Hooray! We're at my polo! Okay, let's try and get through without dying, hopefully. I should have really bought some armor, but oh well. So, I kind of mind out for thousands of thousands of often than ever, hoping to get really far in the overworld so I could just have a fun place. I was thinking about building my own castle, because I wanted a long-term project, and I thought that would be fun. But every time I tried to get on land, I kept on landing in the water. It was very annoying into this cave, but if I can find the exit, because I haven't played this in a while, I don't remember exactly where the exit is. But, if I remember correctly, it's not too far. I feel like I can jump over this. Go up this way. Right. Yeah. Nope. Uh, maybe go down here. Just AI there. And we go down. Into a section with more level. This is the wrong way. I feel like I can't remember where my exit is. But what or so I'm gonna cut to when I actually find it because just looking around the cave is Okay, I found the area where I normally swim up. I'm gonna quickly eat though so that I can heal, otherwise I won't survive what I'm trying to show off. But hopefully I can just get enough air to live. So let's go up. Up. So this is where I changed my idea a bit, and you are about to see why. If we can see it before I die. It's time to die, folks. There. There is the sea temple. I was planning to get a friend to help me kill the sea, uh, whatever it's called, the sea mobs, and be, and be able to make a underwater dome. I thought it'd be a really interesting idea to have my very own underwater dome, where I could see a sea temple, and I thought that would be a great idea. So. Uh, but I was unable to do it because I couldn't get my fr uh, friend to join me um, in time, basically. And this will be the last I see of this server. Um, uh, this is really a sad time, but I hope you've enjoyed this last video. And I'll see you in the next one, which will probably not be Minecraft for a while. Bye.